Welcome to Sweet Talk SLP. I'm Crystal and I'm a pediatric speech language pathologist. Today I'll be sharing my SLP Amazon favorites. But before we get started, if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, I invite you to subscribe, like this video, and share with your friends. Let's get started. We are days away from Amazon Prime Days. Last year, I shared my Amazon recommendations and wish lists, like all my Amazon recommendations. And although that list is still current and I still believe in all those products and I still enjoy them very much, I wanted to make this video to share just my absolute favorites, my top five favorites. I'm not gonna list them in any particular order. I'm just gonna share my favorites with you. Some of them are kind of categorized and they're items that I buy from Amazon regularly and some are very specific. So we'll just get started. One of the first things that I like to purchase from Amazon are learning resources, toys, and activities in general. I like to track their prices on Amazon to see if they go up and down when they're on sale. And so I imagine some of these will be on sale during Amazon Prime Days. And if not, this is something you can add to your wish list for later and track the prices just like I do. Some of the favorites that I have from learning resources that I use quite regularly are the Rock and Gem toy, the Counting Surprise Party, and Spike the Hedgehog. Um, but there are so many <laughs> learning resources toys. And of course they can be purchased at Target and other places online, but Amazon is my place for learning resources. I also really enjoy buying Goliath games on Amazon. Now I haven't purchased all of them on Amazon. There have been a few times where I've found a random Goliath game at Marshall's and the price was just too good to pass up. But I do like to track the prices on Amazon to see them go up and down and when they're on sale. Not too long ago I bought Burping Bobby on a really good sale um, and so I feel like it's a really good place to track the prices and I'm just like the learning resources, I'm sure one or two or three of them will be on sale during the Amazon Prime Day sales. Some of my favorites are Banana Blast, Jumpy Jack, Pop the Pig. Um, I bought Burping Bobby, but I haven't used it yet, so I don't know how much I love it. But if it's on a super sale, maybe something to consider. This is a newer toy and it's a very specific toy. And I don't know if you can buy it anywhere else, but I've seen other SLPs post on social media this very specific toy. And it is the spinning stacking toy that has usually five different gears that you can place on top and it spins all the way down to the bottom. There are many different ones on Amazon. I just looked for the cheapest one when I was looking for one myself, but it has been such a great toy to have and I've been really enjoying it. I've been working on requesting for more, requesting for help, putting it together, putting them like on the gear, um, helping to remove them. Um, so it's been very fun and engaging for my speech therapy sessions, especially for my younger populations. I really love buying board books on Amazon. As with all the products, I do keep them on my wish list and I do look for them to go on sale. Um, sometimes they have, you know, buy two, get one free or things like that. And so sometimes I buy them during that time. I don't know what kind of sale they'll have on children's books, but if you're looking for children's books in general or board books, this is definitely a time to just kind of peek to see if there are any that you have been looking at. I really like this good night series like good night monkey good night lion i just saw that they have a good night cat a good night dog that i had not seen before i have seen one book at marshall's before and i've heard that they're kind of out right now and so if you're able to find them at marshall's i feel like they're about five dollars and on amazon depending on the book they're anywhere from about eight to twelve thirteen dollars so it might be a better buy at a marshall's if you can find them and if not Amazon is a great way to track the price and see them go up and down. I also love polka dot books by Melissa and Doug. I like the High Five series of High Five Animals, High Five Farm. Um, recently I purchased the Color Bus book. So it has like a large puzzle piece that you can put together with different colors of vehicles, which is really nice. And then I recently also bought the What's in My House book, which I also really love, but I think board books in general. Some of the classics are on there, Brown Bear, Brown Bear, The Very Hungry Caterpillar. So you can find some really great deals on children's books. And last but not least, mesh zipper bags. I love these bags. I've bought them tons of times. I've started with the assortment of sizes. And so I've bought the assorted 
sizes two or three different times and recently I've been purchasing you know I've purchased a couple of sets of very specific sizes that I feel I use more that fit some of my wooden puzzles some that fit some of my interactive adaptive books that I've um, put together that are about the size of a half of a page so I've you know made the smaller books and so they fit in some of these smaller sizes and so I love these bags I put anything that has pieces into these bags so my jumping jack and banana blast games each one has their own bag with all the pieces inside instead of having the boxes since I do work out of my car it's just easier for me to have them in these bags like I said puzzle pieces books that have interactive pieces or pieces that could fall out I put them in there um, mini objects I just everything even that gear toy that spinning toy that I was talking about broken up fits in a small bag um, and I love having it in there we have to work on opening the bag to take all the pieces out and then the little rod that goes on the base is not already placed in there so that is an opportunity to have to help for that and then putting all the pieces together so um, probably one of my number one Amazon purchases from year to date and it probably will always be one of my favorites I'm pretty sure I recommended it in my other video I'd love to know what you're planning to buy during Amazon Prime days I don't have anything on my wish list right now but that could definitely change <laughs> I want to thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, I hope that you'll consider subscribing. Like this video, share it with your friends, ring that notification bell, you'll be notified of my weekly uploads. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you on the next one.